Michigan State is having what I call faux quarterback controversy. Now, you're going to say, Greg, how is it faux? Mel Tucker has been outspoken about the fact that they are having an open quarterback competition. I, I know that they're having an open quarterback competition, but is it more for optics? Like, hey, Peyton, you haven't earned the starting quarterback job, or is it a real legitimate quarterback competition? I, I really want to know that. And I think we might be able to find that out as they take to the field on Saturday. Now, those that are vying for the job, if you will, considering they called their depth chart, quote, fluid, Peyton Thorne is the incumbent, did take a little bit of a step back last year, no denying that, but he didn't have the run game support that he had two years ago, so a step back would be expected. He had to carry a little more of the load. Now, can he adequately carry the load if the run game isn't what it was in 21 and make better decisions along the way? I mean, we are talking about a guy that did, just a couple years ago, have a sensational season complimenting Kenneth Walker in that run game and bringing out the best in what was a very underappreciated wide receiver core coming in to that season, but clearly proved that they could play at a really high level with great athleticism. Now, the comp competition alongside Thorne. You got Noah Kim and he got freshman Katten Hauser. Kim does have some experience and has played in relief at times, been efficient in those relief appearances, 14 of 19 for 174 and three touchdowns. But those competition that he played against, not necessarily what you would expect when he's facing off against some of the better teams in the Big Ten. Is this a real competition? If I see Kim splitting reps with Peyton Thorne with the ones, if I see them getting Hauser in there a little bit as well, then I might be a little bit more open to the idea that this thing really is up for grabs heading into the summer. Let's find that out as they take to the field on Saturday.